Hey guys, uh, I know it's been a while since uh, my last tutorial. I was, uh, was on a little bit of a hiatus. I had some, had a lot of shit going on, but uh, I'm back, and uh, this one's a little bit more advanced. Because what it is is it's phase lighting, except done with a script, as opposed to the way I showed you in the other phase lighting video. And uh, it's a pretty big script, as you can see. I mean, it's not big in comparison to like software scripting, but for you know a ZDoom map, it's it's fairly large. Um, I'll explain it the best I can. Um, these pound defines are just uh, some constants that we're going to use throughout the script. Um, fade rate is for um, the lights that have already passed. It fades them by this amount. So you can change this so that they fade faster or slower. Uh, low light is <coughs> what it sets the light to after it's done uh, fading. Uh, high light is obviously the higher when you know when the light is lit in the front sector. Uh, last sector is 28 because what I've in first sector is one because I've tagged these. You can see sector tag one, two, and all the way up to 28. Oops. And then uh, this here is just defining the name of the script. Uh, and then script one, uh, it defines I, which is our counter, and then it does uh, a for loop right here. And since if I is equal to first sector and less than last sector, it increases the counter and it changes the value. And then, depending on this value right here, ooh, excuse me, it's fucking 10:30 in the morning. I woke up only a half hour ago. <laughs> And then, depending on this variable, it uh, executes either these two scripts. Um, this one it sets the counter to the first sector tag. It dims it, and then it increases and goes to the next sector. And then, if it gets to the last sector, it loops right back to the first. And then, it sets the sector to the, the bright color, obviously. And then, the delay for the light fade is set to light delay. Uh, you can change this to lower so that'll go faster. I'm going to set it to like 2 and see how fast it goes. Um, and then script 3 is just the same thing as this except backwards. It just, it, it, uh, it'll send the lights back the other way. So, I'll just show you real quick. Here's our, here's our, you know, big snake of lights. So our first one. Damn, one is really cool because that's going really fast. Now, this one goes the other way. And that's what you can do with just, you know, this script. And I mean, it's not like you're going to have to memorize it because I've told, I've, I say it every time I, I do a video scripting in it. Save the script into a text file somewhere so that you can use it whenever the hell you need it. Um, it was so much easier to just copy and paste something. God damn it! Then, uh, <laughs> then, uh, you know, I have to type it over and over again. I mean, it's good to type them because then you learn uh, the commands and stuff. But I mean, I'm pretty sure you can pick it up just from from reading it and seeing how the script works and stuff. Um, but that's pretty much all there is to this one. Uh, you just put in the script, tag your sectors, and put in a switch to activate it. <coughs> And then you're you're good. <coughs> but uh, I'm probably going to be making more tutorials now that I'm back into the swing of things. And uh, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already.